Welcome ladies and gentlemen to Bubbly Tech. In this video I'm going to be reviewing the Boya BY-M1 lavalier microphone. This is a microphone that can be used with a wide variety of different tech products such as cameras, phones, laptops, PCs and much more. It costs just under $20 and for the price I was very surprised. If you guys want to buy it I will leave a link down in the description but with that being said let's get into the actual unboxing. Now let's see what you get in the box when you buy the microphone. First you get the microphone itself, a foam windscreen, a clothing clip, an LR44 battery, a 3.5 to 6.3 millimeter adapter, a carrying pouch made of pleather and a user manual. The microphone itself is made from plastic, the 20 feet cable is made from rubber and the inline capsule that houses the battery and a switch to change between phone and camera use is made from aluminium. The included clothing clip is also made from aluminium and the carrying case is made from pleather. Now let's cover some specifications. The microphone itself has an omnidirectional pickup pattern, a frequency range from 65Hz to 18kHz, a sensitivity of minus 30 decibels and an impedance of 1000 ohms. Now let's test the audio quality of this microphone. I'm going to be using a wide variety of different products so we'll get a feeling of how the microphone performs. This is an audio test of my Canon 200D's inbuilt microphone. This is an audio test of the Boya microphone plugged right into my camera. This is an audio test of my Samsung Galaxy S9's inbuilt microphone. This is an audio test of the Boya microphone plugged straight into my Samsung Galaxy S9. This is an audio test of the Boya microphone plugged right into my laptop. This is an audio test of the microphone plugged straight into my Windows computer. Now let's cover the pros and the cons of the microphone. For the pros, this microphone is universally compatible. It has a 700 hour battery life. It sounds great for the price. It has a very long cable and it is super super cheap. For the cons, the microphone has a non-standard battery. The build quality isn't amazing but for the price I really can't complain too much and it has a super long cable. In conclusion, I recommend this microphone to people looking for a good lav mic on a budget. It's great for people starting out on YouTube creating content in front of a camera. Now the exception to this are vloggers. The 20 foot cable is way too long and unpractical for someone carrying a camera around all day but for the average video maker on a budget this microphone is great. Now if you'd like to buy the microphone I will leave a link down in the description along with a link to where you can buy some additional batteries for the microphone. If you guys enjoyed the video make sure to give it a like and subscribe, follow me on Instagram links down in the description and with that being said this was Bubbly and I'm signing out.